Hello friends, today let us see how to install python on raspberry pi and how to work with it. I have connected my raspberry pi to my laptop through LAN cable and I have shared my internet connection to it. You can check out my previous tutorial on how to connect raspberry pi to laptop display if you don't have an HDMI cable. Press Windows button plus R, you will get the run window, type CMD, press OK, type ping space raspberry pi dot ms home dot net. So it will automatically ping the raspberry pi which is connected to your laptop. Here my raspberry pi address is given by 192.168.137.148 so now let us connect to the raspberry pi through vnc server you should have vnc viewer installed in your computer so i have typed 192.168.137.148 as it is and colon 1 don't forget to enter this colon 1 click connect click on continue now you get the raspberry pi display go to menu system tools and click on lx terminal ok now let us login as super user for that you can type sudo su first let us update our raspberry pi for that type apt dash get update it takes 2 or 3 minutes to update please wait ok python development has been installed now let us install python virtual environment for that type apt dash get python dash virtual env oh sorry apt dash get install i forgot to type install install python dash virtual env wait for some time in that time let us move on to browser to see the guide type it as docs dot python dash guid guide dot org slash en slash latest slash dev slash virtual envs again a forward slash hit enter you will get a guide for virtual environment on python how to work with it so this is the page where you can learn about virtual environment on creating a virtual environment and working with virtual environment Now let us get back to our installation. So yes, it has been installed. The virtual environment has been installed now. Now let us install Python PIP. To install that, type apt dash get install python dash pip.
okay python pip has been installed now let us navigate to vr directory create a new directory called working for that use mkdir now we have created a new directory called working let us move into that directory type cd cd is nothing but change directory working we are into working directory type virtual env space venv venv is nothing but virtual environment press enter so it has set up the tools let us see what all the files has been installed okay i have venv directory let me move into that i have this all these files and uh, let me move into bin directory we have all this to activate the virtual environment files and other things let's get back okay now we are in working directory let me clear all this stuff now let us activate virtual environment directory for that type dot space env forward slash bin slash activate here you can see venv has come in brackets this means that the virtual environment has been activated to deactivate python virtual environment just type deactivate and hit enter you can see that virtual environment is deactivated let me activate it again okay now let us get back to this browser type it as docs.docs.python.org here click on tutorial you will get all the tutorial and guide and examples on how to run python on raspberry pi here let us see this using python as a calculator to add numbers if you just type 2 plus 2 plus 2 it will add and give you the result as 4 also if you want to do arithmetic operations you can do it in python you can do it easily now let us see how we can do the mathematical operations type python okay to add numbers let me type 2 plus 2 so the result is 4 you get the answers directly now let us let us try for 11 star 22 we get the direct result let me check out this thing i will copy this press control shift plus v to paste so we get the answer as 5 so the mathematical operation is working let us try with using variables i will assign width as 20 and height as 5 into 9 so if i calculate the width into height i should get the result as 900 so yes i am getting the result exact result so this is working with variables and numbers now let us move on to the strings type in single quotes spam x yes you are getting it now let me 
work with this list squares squares is equal to 9 comma 15 comma 25 So if I type squares, I get the list. Let me type some program such as Fibonacci series. Let us try out this Fibonacci series. A comma B is equal to zero comma one. We are initializing it while B is less than. Ten, a colon, press two spaces, give two space, type print of B, press enter again, give two spaces, a comma B is equal to. B comma A plus B. Again, just press enter. Yes, you are getting the answer. So this is how you can work with Python in virtual environment in on Raspberry Pi. In the next tutorial, we shall see how to access GPIO pins on Raspberry Pi using Python. Thank you.